death of scuba diver during training sparks debate. Craig Lehner was a canine police officer in Buffalo. He joined the underwater recovery team to further his career. But sadly, on a training day, he ran into some trouble. He was in the fast waters of the Niagara River when he seemed to be struggling. Because of the current, Craig was hard to get to and sadly he disappeared downriver. It took five days to find his body and turns out that the cable that connected him to the rest of the team broke, leaving him alone underwater. Now his sister Donna and others have filed a notice of claim, which is the first step in a lawsuit against the city of Buffalo. The claims alleged that the training exercise was allowed to take place despite dangerous conditions. Craig wasn't trained or supervised when he went into the water, there was inadequate communication systems for the divers, and the diving equipment was dangerous and unsafe amongst other claims. These claims, of course, now have people worried about the safety of other officers of Buffalo, and if these claims are found to be true, that means a mass overhaul will be needed. Our thoughts are, of course, with Craig Lehner's family and friends. It's sad that a tragedy like this is needed to start an inquiry into the quality of equipment and training, but we'd love to hear your thoughts about all of this. Should they look into how they train recovery divers? Should they have taken Craig into the river in the first place? Let's discuss respectfully in the comments. Thanks for watching, safe diving.